So this isn't gonna be a long video, but I hope it's gonna be an exciting one because I have some exclusive pictures and video of a new GM prototype truck that I wanna share with you. So with that, let's get going. So as I said at the top of the video, I have some exclusive pictures and a video to show you today of a new prototype GM truck. Thanks to my friend on Instagram who shared it with me, Stack the Pads Goaltending. So it's at Stack the Pads Goaltending if you want to check him out, who shared these pictures and a small video with me today. And we're going to get to that in one second, but before we get there, let me just read something very quickly to you, which is going to lead into what I am going to be talking about, and that is this right here. GM Defense LLC is expanding its global strategy to Canada, leveraging the existing relationships of GM Canada, along with the advanced technologies and capabilities of its parent company, General Motors, with the aim of... Um, uh, delivering efficient and innovative solutions to international military security and government customers. Now, why am I saying this? Well, there is a reason. Just today and happening tomorrow in Ottawa, Canada, there is a conference going on called the CADSI or C-A-D-S-I, and that stands for the Canadian Association of Defense and Security Industries Trade Show. And that happens to be where my friend was, who got these pictures and video of a new defense truck, which they are calling the light duty vehicle prototype. So GM Defense's light vehicle, uh, light utility vehicle prototype. But as you can see from the pictures, this is not a light vehicle from what I can see. It looks like it's based off an HD truck. And we're going to get to that here in a second. But if you're not aware of this, of course, GM Defense makes some pretty cool vehicles. In fact, they made one, um, you know, not too long ago that really looked kind of like the Beast, right? Remember that Beast vehicle um, that uh, that concept they had? It's called, uh, they have what's basically called the Infantry Squad Vehicle uh, developed for the U.S. Army. Well, now it looks like they're doing a truck. And it looks, again, like it's based off an HD platform. So there's a couple things I'm excited about in regards to this truck. First and foremost, I love how it looks. I love that front end. I am wondering, just a very curious thought, imagine they adopted that front end to the new 2024 refresh trucks. What's your thoughts on that, first of all? Because I think that that would be pretty cool. Secondly, I love that flat green color. I think that would actually be a cool color just to sell uh, an HD truck. And now it looks to me like it's maybe built more so off of the Chevy platform, uh, obviously uh, of the HD. But what's really interesting about this truck is what's underneath it. It is not a normal HD truck. It's actually an electric truck. Yes. And as you can see from the pictures in the video here, um, it has the, it has a drive on the front and a drive on the rear, which of course is going to have, you know, massive horsepower. And maybe it's utilizing and looking something along the lines of maybe the Hummer or the Silverado EV. Now I know that we're still going to have to have gas. And actually one of the trucks that I guess they're, they're apparently building as well is a diesel hybrid. I think that's what uh, he told me now that I can't confirm, but that's what I heard. But these pictures are super exciting. I want to share this truck with take because I just thought it was something different and I would love to see if any of the front end of this lends itself to what we're going to see potentially on the new HD trucks especially if you didn't already know this in the HD trucks coming out there is going to be as far as my understanding a ZR2 pardon me ZR2 for my American friends and AT4X versions so off-road versions of the 2500 series trucks like we're seeing right now on the half ton trucks which is super exciting and obviously what better way to get some off-road you know off-road uh, items and qual and, and items and stuff like that from that but from gm defense right and we can use that potentially in these off-road trucks so anyways super exciting i just want to show you this today any questions on this or any comments is for, of course if i get more details on this i'm going to share it with you going forward but that's all i know of it so far but anyways i hope everybody's uh having a great day and thanks so much for watching take care